This week on The Modified World, I'm stabbing mother-daughter combos and celebrating milestones. So, stick around. Welcome to the Modified World. It's the weekly web show about body modification. People who do it, people get it. What matters? I am JC Potts. The reason you pay attention to anything that I have to say is because I am the senior piercer at Pangea Piercing. It's quite a well-known studio up in Ann Arbor, Michigan. I purvey internet wackiness. At least that's what they tell me. This week, this week I had a nice mother-daughter combo come all the way from Cincinnati, Ohio. That is not a short drive. It's really cool too because, well, while daughter wanted to get septum piercing and one of my least favorite piercings to do because they are difficult, mom let me get creative, which, you know, doesn't happen as much as I'd like to have happen. You know, people a lot of times will be approaching Mr. Josh Campbell for his beautiful ear piercing creations so this time I was like well hey you know I'll take a page out of Campbell's playbook since mom has the idea of like hey well we'll let JC get creative well let me get kind of creative so I came up with the industrial strength fittings made a little v-shaped industrial and anodized it yeah all onyx and black CZ gemstones through a two millimeter bezel set neo metal piece in there too popped it all together worked out nice and of course too since i punched it all in there i have no kind of concerns or qualms about like you know healing processes or anything like that daughter septum was relatively non-stressful too i kind of cheat on those i use three inch needles to kind of help visualize angles a little bit better eh. not easy though Never are. If you've seen my other piercing septum videos, then you'll know kind of what my thoughts on the situation are. Easy to do, but not easy to do well. So we had another milestone to this week. I passed 10,000 subscribers on Instagram, which is kind of cool. You know, I don't even really focus on Instagram stuff all that much. So, hey, I appreciate that too. We're going to wind up having some sort of free stuff giveaway shiny things precious gemstones god knows what i'm gonna do that again too when we hit a hundred thousand on youtube because i want that silver play button we deserve it it's a sad state of affairs that i could be half my age female cute and just talk about my sex life and get you know 10 times the amount of viewership this is stuff you need not necessarily stuff you want so that makes it kind of tough but anyway Thanks for the 10,000 followers on Instagram. We've never bought likes, we've never bought followers, we've never gamed the system at all. So I do greatly appreciate you guys' love and support. While I've got y'all's attention, I will be going to Florida to Randall Como's shop here in January. It's coming up here in a few weeks actually, like six weeks as of this air date. And after eight, nine years in frozen Michigan, you know, I am starting to, starting to dread the winters a little bit. So, I am interested in doing other guest spots in warm locations, please, during this winter. So, where do you guys want me? Southern California, Arizona, Miami Beach? I, I'm not super picky, but I need to know where I'm going and I only want to go where I'm really wanted or needed or any of that type of stuff. So, once again, let me know. Comment section. It's a thing on YouTube. People use it sometimes. And also, too, guys, come on, man. I looked at the share statistics on some of this stuff. And, guys, seriously, there are literally no more shares going on now than there ever has been since literally since we started. I, I know it's kind of standard youtube thing to ask for everybody's help and getting the word out but man we really really need it man i mean not asking for much doesn't cost anything and doesn't hurt plus you never know we might actually give you something for it it's happened in the past so go ahead share one of my videos and throw me a subscription and all that other 
YouTubery type stuff. And of course, stop back by next week. I'll have another episode of The Modified World.